The Royal Navy just made aviation history. For the first time ever, a British aircraft carrier is hosting the largest number of F-35B Lightning II jets ever assembled on a single ship. This milestone reshapes the power projection capability of the UK and sets a new benchmark for Allied carrier operations. HMS Queen Elizabeth is now carrying a record-breaking full deck of F-35Bs, combining jets from both the Royal Air Force and US Marine Corps. This is the largest combined fifth-generation carrier air wing ever put to sea outside the United States. The deployment proves that the UK's flagship carrier can operate at the scale required for real combat operations instead of limited training missions. F-35Bs are extremely demanding aircraft. Their short takeoff and vertical landing operations require complex choreography, strict deck management and advanced maintenance cycles. Hosting this many at once shows the carrier can support sustained high-tempo sorties, rapid turnarounds and multi-nation interoperability. For NATO, this means a fully operational British strike carrier, capable of running air dominance, deep strike, ISR and electronic warfare missions across Europe, the Middle East and the Indo-Pacific. This deployment blends aircraft and crews from the combined air wing gives the carrier more range, higher sortie rate and deeper weapons integration across NATO's most advanced fifth generation platform. With this many F-35Bs aboard, the strike group can launch simultaneous offensive and defensive missions, support long-range precision strikes, conduct stealth reconnaissance over contested airspace, provide air cover for NATO ships and ground forces, execute rapid response operations anywhere in the world. This is the closest the UK has come to fielding a full-scale carrier strike air wing since the Cold War. The record deployment comes during a period of rising tensions, from Eastern Europe to the Red Sea. NATO leaders have emphasised the need for more fifth-generation air power at sea. The UK demonstrating this capability sends a message. Britain can field a real, combat-ready carrier strike force without relying on the US Navy. The Royal Navy plans to continue expanding operations, integrating more F-35Bs into future deployments and refining combined UK-USMC air wing tactics. This record-setting mission is a preview of what a fully equipped British carrier group could bring to future conflicts. The UK's flagship just proved it can run with the world's most advanced carrier fleets, more jets, more capability, more reach. This isn't a symbolic milestone, it's a real shift in global naval power.